here are the five ways you can find really good clients. This is probably the number one question I get ever, always, from anyone who's ever talked to me says, Beate, I understand your strategist, but please, by all means, save that. Just tell me how I'm going to find really good clients. So my answer to that is just wait one minute and I'll give you five strategies. My name is Beate Chalet. I'm the growth architect. I am a strategic advisor from startups to Fortune 100 companies, and I help organizations to identify why their businesses are not growing or where they're stuck, and then devise through my five-star success blueprint solutions and helping them grow. So how do you find clients? Number one, you have to be really clear what it is that you're doing. So that is often a misconception when I talk to someone and say, well, what do you do? And then they stumble along and they bumble along and they go, well, you know, I, I, you know, sometimes I do this, sometimes I do that. If you are not clear what you're doing, you can't find the right client. So that's where you have to start. Number one, figure out what you are, who you are, what you're really good at, what your superpower is, and then do that really well. Number two, how do you find really good clients? You are going to have to be where these ideal clients are hanging out. So once you know what you do, then you figure out who is this problem, who, who has this problem, and then you need to go to where those people are. In, um, in a normal time, we would go to conferences and we'd go to places and network meetings where these people are hanging out, which you kind of can't do right now. So now you have to expand your strategy in finding these people on places like Clubhouse or Facebook or Google or um, LinkedIn and have a completely different strategy in place of identifying where these clients really are. Strategy number four on how to find really good clients is when you are creating a lead magnet and you are um, putting something out there that's considered very valuable for other people. And so when people are seeing that as you're advertising this, you can get people into your funnel and you start generating leads and then you lead them through your funnel and then you can eventually sell to them. Now that of course means that you have to advertise that in some way or form and that's my strategy number five and my strategy number five in how to find clients is speaking. So I do a lot of speaking on podcasts and summits and, you know, obviously I do professional speaking, motivational speaking, I get hired as a speaker. And so when you are in front of an audience, you can warm them up. And then when you make an offer, you know, leading them to your lead generation piece, that is a really easy way for you to have them start to trust you. They heard you, they heard your story and they are you know, excited about you. And I mean, look at all the podcasts and the opportunities out there that where um, a lot of these hosts are looking for an audience, um, not just an audience, but for, for speakers who are willing to share their story. So as they grow, you will grow. So these are my five strategies for you for today on how to find good clients and how to find clients and where to find clients and somehow all the different elements that go into it. If you like this video, please press like right now and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. This is Beat Goodbye.